Barack Athaya Hawa, Barack Athaya Hawa Shah, Barack Athaya Hawa, Barack Athaya Hawa Shah, all praise to Yahawa, Baha Shem Yahawa Shah, Baha Shem Kakadash, Yahawa in the name of the Heavenly Father, Yahawa Shah in the name of His only begotten Son, who they eagerly called Jesus Christ. Now, I want to base this uh, lesson off um, Second Ezra chapter 6. And it pretty much show how in the end, in the last days, that truth will come out and prevail. And this is what um, King Solomon wrote in Proverbs, where he say um, that the light will get brighter, see, because we, this world is in gross darkness. Esau, Edom, the so-called white man, he has the, the world in gross darkness because he loved to tell a bold-faced lie and spread misinformation and he spread lies all day, every day, propaganda, public relations, uh, some skills he learned from Edward Bernays and uh, his forefather Esau, see, in the spirit of uh, the Antichrist and uh, the deceiver. This is what he operate in. When you go into that fourth kingdom, which is Esau's kingdom, in um, Second Ezra 11, it talks about the same thing. And let me start off with that. Um, Second Ezra. Let's see here. That fourth kingdom. Second Ezra 11, 38. It says here in um, 40. He says, And the fourth came and overcame all the beasts that were past and had power over the world with great fearfulness. See, this is what these Edomites, they got power over the whole world. It says, and over the whole compass of the earth with much wicked oppression. You can see with their military, they um, rape, rob, and murder people all over the globe. It says, and so long dwelt he upon the earth with the sea. For the earth have thou not judge with truth. See, they don't run this earth with truth. They run the earth with a bold-faced lie. See, talking about they done discovered some crap and acting like uh, people they didn't nobody knew that this side of the world existed when they got all kind of history showing that this side of the uh, earth existed. You see? So when you go on to 2nd Ezra 6, um, where is it? Like 20-something. 20 27. It says, For evil shall be put out, and deceit shall be quenched. So the deceit that, he run, that he's running the world with, it's going to be quenched. It's going to be put out. 28, it says, As for faith, it shall flourish. So that it's going to flourish in the last days. That's why Daniel said that the book shall be opened in the last days. Um, in Isaiah 29, say that the books shall be opened in the last days. The seal that was put on the book, it shall be um, opened up. It says, corruption shall be overcome, and the truths which have been so long without fruit shall be declared. So now we're seeing the truth is being declared that the so-called white man is the Edomites. He is the one that's lying, running his kingdom with um, running his kingdom with a bunch of lies. And just like here in Jeremiah 51, it says, Behold, I am against you, O destroying mountain. See, the Lord is against him. Says the Lord, which destroys all the world. See, not only is he lying, he destroying the whole world, man. He is Satan, the devil. See, he is the destroyer.
the son of perdition. This is what Apostle Paul was talking about. This is going to be revealed who this son of perdition is. Because this is 51 is talking about the same people 50 is talking about. And 47 tells you who it's talking about in verse 7. Say concerning Edom. You see, look at verse 10. It says, but I have made Esau bear. I have uncovered his secret places. And she, he shall not be able to hide himself. See, he's going to reveal these Edomites in the last days and expose all of their lives. That's why it says in verse 7, is wisdom no more in teeming? Because they were so wise enough to hide all of this, this stuff from people. But now that wisdom that they was using to hide this stuff and to spread misinformation is being quenched. I mean, it's being put out. And so I want to just bring that out real quick through the Spirit. All praise to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shah, by Hashem, Rikaka Dash. Uh, double honors to the elders pushing the truth. PCD, elect worldwide. The blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. Descendants of slaves scattered around the globe on slave ships and through many captivities. Our kingdom is at hand. Shalom.